Hello, hello, welcome back to the channel. Today I wanna to show you how you can find out how much your Performance Max campaigns are spending on shopping campaigns or shopping placements. Um, so it's a very unique trick. I actually just uh, saw this from one of my employees, Leksha, great guy, great specialist as well. And I'm very happy that he found this because I thought right now the only reporting feature that we had from uh, Pmax was for placements on uh, where ads are actually showing on what sites. So let's get into it. So overall, very easy to do. So just go up to reports on the top right here. You can do predefined if you want, and then other, and then Pmax campaign placement. And I'll just get you there first, and then we can kind of uh, go into more detail here. So let's break it down. Let me make this smaller. So what we want to do is uh, just uh, delete this. You can delete these. So you can actually just go to you know <laughs> report if you want to. This is just how he showed me to do it. And what we want to do here in the row, we want to do. Uh, MC ID, which is your merchant account, uh, merchant center ID, put that in the row. So now you have your uh, GMC linked up here. And now uh, you can do pretty much any overall metrics you want to look at. So I would look at first impressions, clicks, uh, cost, CPC. Um, and let's do, uh, I don't know if you can do conversions and stuff. I think you can, yeah. Conversions, conversion value. No, we can't do that. And maybe cost. Okay, so that's a, as far as you can go. Um, these are the, the main thing is just kind of seeing cost, honestly, and overall performance of that. <clears throat> so looking here now, what we want to do is then add a filter. <clears throat> so I go here. Then you do campaign, and now you can do, let's just do this Pmax one. So apply, and now I can see in this one Pmax campaign, I'm spending eight, in the last, uh, in, the, in the 30 days right, right now, I'm spending 845, and I got about five conversions so far of 1400 clicks. So this is direct shopping campaign placements, and I also believe dynamic marketing on the display side as well, if that uh, is in GMC, not totally sure on that. But this kind of gives you insights on actually looking at how much your Pmax is spending on shopping versus other channels. Um, and I'm not going to show you here just because it cannot um, show the client results there. But what you can do is then cross-reference this with the actual campaign. So if you really wanted to see, okay, how much of my budget is actually being spent on shopping, go back to your camp this campaign, so my Pmax sh Smart Shopping, this one. And then I would go back in the, in the same time, time view, so one or August 1st to the 30th see if the total spend, let's say it's $1,000 total spend, I know about 85% of my budget is being spent on the shopping network. Um, so this is a, just a good little tool here to kind of view your performance max campaigns and how they actually spend. I think the best use case is if you ever try running um, an asset only PMAX campaign and a listing group only PMAX campaign. So kind of if, you're, if you want to limit it to shopping versus non-shopping, um, this is a good way to kind of make sure Google is actually spending this. And actually that's how my uh, employee showed me this. He, we were looking at kind of how does that break up uh, overall, like these two campaigns, is it spending shoppings and not, and it was. So it was a good area to kind of test this, and this is just another insight further into what you can actually do with reporting, and one step further that Google doesn't really tell you about. So that's how you find out uh, how much your performance max campaigns are actually spending on shopping placements. So there you go.